We're at FDS Manufacturing Company in Pomona, California. We manufacture corrugated paper products and plastic packaging for industrial and agricultural uses. Our plastic products are fruit trays and clamshells for produce. We're doing 100 million clamshells a year. We're very seasonal as well. So during those seasonal times, it gets pretty crazy and there's a lot of uh, products <laughs> moving out of the, out the front door. We made a decision seven or eight years ago that we had to actually make our own plastic sheets to be competitive in the clamshell and the fruit tray market. At that time, we needed to add machinery that was very energy intensive. And we also recognized that there's a massive amount of cooling that's required and also a drying requirement on the PET. So, 24-7 we basically run that machine and there's a real need for inexpensive power. It became real apparent that our payback would be very quick. We purchased six capstone turbines. Two of the turbines are used to crystallize and also dry PET plastic material for our extrusion line. The purpose of the capstone turbines on the drying side of things was to offset the natural gas usage of uh, two natural gas burners that use 385,000 BTUs an hour of natural gas. By adding those capstone turbines in, we're able to turn those burners off completely. Four of the turbines are used to create hot water. That hot water is used through a Thermax absorption chiller where we then generate 45 degree chilled water to cool the plastic during the extrusion process and also our thermoforming process. We estimate that our efficiency by utilizing the waste heat is approaching 80% efficiency of the energy put into the capstones. Overall, we've got way over 90% uptime, probably closer to 98%. I think the capstones ought to be at every manufacturing facility actually across the country. It allows a manufacturing company to have more control of their needs and costs. They've been uh, very uh, reliable and we look forward to installing another six turbines here in the future.